Honey, I'm home. Hmm? Honey? Babe, you hiding over here? <laughs> Found you. Guess who? <laughs> Guilty as fucking charged, I guess. I managed to get us a little safer after all the destruction the last time. Come here. <sighs> you know, I miss this a lot, right? Just wasn't the same as how you. <sighs> and you look amazing considering all the things we went through today, yesterday, last week. It's been a mess, hasn't it? Oh, no. See you like that? I can't help but just want to hold you. <laughs> Come on, babe. You should know by now. I'm hopelessly in love. Half a bastard at this point. And, well, you know the rest of it. I don't have to explain myself, do I? After everything we've been through, I mean, I'd say you know me almost better than I know myself. Of course, the opposite is true, too. <laughs> Come on over. Don't be shy now. I mean, what's the point, right? Been through all this, and all I can think of is I'd do it all again with you. <laughs> Dancing to our own tune. Surviving by the skin of our teeth. <laughs> oh, is that it? <laughs> I couldn't help myself sometimes just thinking about it. When you'd get home, when I'd get home, went back and forth, right? You are a good sidekick. I'm here to fucking tell you. I mean, half the times, I wouldn't have made it through the mission without you. And as much as I'd like to relax today, we have to go out and do a mission. You ready for it? <laughs> I thought you might be stir-crazy. Well, before that, I want to take my time. You know how it is, right? But with those eyes, I wonder... You really? No one's in store. <laughs> I'll tell you. Nothing too special, I fucking promise, but shit. I just. I'm glad you're in one piece. <laughs> you know, I started panicking there for a second. <laughs> when I couldn't find you, I thought about it. A time along, a long ways back. When I thought I'd lost you. I thought it was all over. That our fun, happy times drew to an end. That all the pain and pleasure and happiness and sadness too. That all of it was for nothing. <laughs> you know why I still didn't regret it? It's even if I... My heart stopped beating right now. And... I'd be thankful for the time I got with you. <laughs> I can't help it, okay? I may not be a hopeless romantic, but I am a lovebird at the end of the day. Ain't that right? <laughs> you've known me for this long, and you've been able to feel my heart beat, and it beats for you, baby. I know I'm more or less talking about nothing, but it's everything to me. And honestly, I know I'll say this a million times more, but you're worth it. You're more than worth it. I've looked into those eyes every day since we've met. It's been years now. Isn't that crazy? Feels like it could be months. That's how fun it is. That time flies when you, when you really love someone a lot. Every moment goes by too quick. 
you get greedy for more of them, right? That's how I feel right now with you in my arms. I like putting these wings around you. So you know, you're safe. And so if there's actually an invisible assassin behind us, you'd have to get through my wings first, right? <laughs> Don't worry about the scars. Back when I was burned, I was thinking, damn, I hope I'll still be able to protect you. I know, maybe it's a little one-track mind of me, but that's why I didn't want to lose him. Fuck flying. It's useful, it's fun, and I'd love to do it with you, but being less able to protect you in a world that probably wants us both dead, I, I hate that worse. <sighs> Somehow I knew you'd say that. Don't think for a second I'm not saying. I know you're talented. I know you can protect us too difference is I don't very much like the idea of falling behind I want to pull my weight that's the same in love I don't just want to be a lazy lover someone who's half baked half there or half interesting <laughs> you know you're something else right all this time I've thought about it, and I can't think of one time I wouldn't relive again. Well, maybe a few for the pain, but everybody goes through pain. Everybody has some measure of the opposite, too. The difference is, I think I've managed to have a life that's worth it in the end. That's why I'm content, but at the same time, a greed won't let me be. Isn't that just like me? <laughs> You've known me this long, so if you want to keep knowing me, then I'd say we both try and at least moderately keep ourselves in check. Or maybe the opposite. Maybe we live like daredevils. I've been thinking that might be the secret how people live long, storied lives doesn't matter how long it is. It's the moments now that I'll always cherish. The moments of tomorrow and yesterday, they matter too. But I'm always in the moment, lost in it. It's too good seeing you like this. <laughs> is that a coy look you just shot me for looking away? <laughs> Don't be that way, baby. Or do. Just don't think I'm not going to tease you for it. <laughs> Just a little. <laughs> Come on. It's not that bad, right? I've never done anything that you've hated too badly, right? Maybe <laughs> just made an honest effort to do something to make your heart raise. That's what I strive for. Do you miss that time when I was standoffish? <laughs> when I could barely tolerate you. You ever wish we went back to that way? <laughs> Sometimes I kind of miss it, you know? I know I said I wouldn't reminisce, but <laughs> maybe I should bully you more. <laughs> you get away with bullying me plenty, so I figured it couldn't hurt that bad, right? <laughs> <laughs> you have the cutest expression right now. That's probably not what you want to hear, is it? You want to hear something more like this. Stay still. Relax. You're such a fucking good guesser. And sure, maybe it's just a kiss. That's all I need. That's all I'd ever need. <laughs> I'm alive for that, but... I'd be happy with all the kisses. 
As long as it's from you, baby. You know, baby bird, I never thought we'd get this far. I know, maybe it's something crass to say, but after everything, I thought maybe we'd have a good few years, but I didn't think we'd still be kicking. I thought all the fun and happiness, it was too good to be true. Thought by now, we'd be cooked goose. And honestly, I am glad we're not, but <laughs> feels like a dream, don't it? The way I can run my hands through your hair or feel your cheek against my palm. All that feels like a dream. Feels so, so close. That warmth. That nice, fuzzy feeling I get in my head every time I kiss you. All of it, every last bit of you that I managed to be a part of. I'm so thankful. Shh, don't worry about that. I know you can hear it, but they're not looking for us today. We're not criminals yet. <laughs> it's more like a anti-hero, maybe. <laughs> What do you think? Should we become phantom thieves? Stealing away that which we need. Making a living through the best, worst way possible. <laughs> Would I be more attractive as a thief? Dashing a thief to steal you away. Or maybe I'd be better off as a secret agent. Turn to the people who are trying to be rid of us. Somehow appeal to them and become a secret agent. You as my other half. Naturally. Going right through the ballroom. Maybe assassins. <laughs> I think I'm sick of assassinations, if I'm honest, but... Stealing things. Now that... That feels like something of a home at this point. I love... Love... <laughs> So badly. Anytime I get to steal your attention and call it cheesy all you want. But I'm not going to change. And I don't think you should either. Unless you really want to. I'd support it. I just think the more I stay me, the more I stay true to myself, the better I'll be for you. And I know what you're thinking. Come on, Kago, think of yourself sometimes. <laughs> and I'm gonna say, <laughs> I think it's the opposite. Think of myself plenty. I mean, have you seen the things I've done to myself? Self-care is kind of second nature right now. And, well, well, I can't say my mental health is all there. So at least, mostly. Thanks to a certain someone constantly meddling, not leaving me alone, not going the other way when you had the choice. Now look at you, wrapped up in this big fucking mess. You ever regret that? <laughs> you could say if you did, but I'm afraid it's too late to go back, right? You think I'd let you? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe just a little. Maybe I'd consider if you, you know, kissed me some more. <laughs> what do you mean that's not the point? Of course it is. The point is that I've got it bad for you. So bad that when I even think of losing you or going away, I think I'd go crazy right on the spot. I don't know what I'd do. But isn't that kind of... the point? We never have to find that out, do we? I must see you for life. I know. Shh. <laughs> You've done so good by me so far. 
I couldn't have asked for a better baby bird to be with me. You're everything. You're amazing. And I mean that. And I mean that so much. Because you made this life of mine that I thought was always going to be coping, pretending to be happy and moving along, smiling and nodding. PR announcements and spotlights that meant nothing. You changed it into a real fairy tale. Well, I don't want to jinx it like that. Maybe less of a fairy tale and more B-rated love story. <laughs> Come on. I'm not blushing. It's just... I couldn't call us a New York Times bestseller yet. If I did that, I'd be jinxing it even more. You know those guys over there? They say everything's a bestseller. But I like ours. Nestled away on the shelf. It stays there until just the right person finds it. Just like you found me. That's how I feel about it. Those amazing little details that add up to something so, so much more. No. Be honest with me, baby bird. You ever get tired of me toting on your every move? <laughs> Maybe sometimes you want me to be just a little different. <laughs> you know, you can be honest, right? Well, I mean, I'm still the man who was shooing you off for your own good. Shouldn't get near me, you remember? <laughs> you kind of failed at that, huh? For someone who's a pipsqueak when it comes to all that. <laughs> I can't help but be glad you were so stubborn. Wonder who you learned that one from. You have to introduce me. <laughs> well, what is it? You got a problem with all this, or maybe you want something more than that. You know, you could tell me. And if I can make it happen, it'd be more than our honeymoon this time. Be something perfect. If perfect even exists to begin with. But I think the closest I've ever felt to perfect was right here like this. Feeling your weight on me. Feeling your breath, your warmth. Closing my eyes and just... It's good to be alive. That's what it feels like. And I can't help it. I love every little moment. And I crave you. And I can lie. The amount of times I thought to myself, I need more of you. No other would do. Can't fucking help it, okay? Guess I'm somewhat of an addict, huh? And I don't expect you to feel exactly what it feels. Maybe you do. Maybe every little feeling is mutual. And maybe I love that. Maybe right now, I keep thinking to myself, I couldn't be luckier, could we? <laughs> yes, something, you know, that? other than your stubborn side and your very cute loving side, you've always got that attitude. <laughs> Can't really put it into words, but it suits you. Makes you different, never gets boring. That's why I keep falling for you over and over again. What do you do to me? Just look at you. <sighs> and with spring and summer, now comes the part where I fall for you. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. That's pretty good, right? <laughs> well, whether it was good or not, we'll leave the jury out on that. 
Instead, I think I'd rather have one of those moments where we maybe do something just a little bit breaking the code at work. <laughs> you know, they say you should never work with your lover, but I think it's quite the opposite. More opportunities to get in trouble? Sign me up. More opportunities to see that expression, that one you're making right now. But you can hardly believe words coming out of my mouth. <laughs> it makes me happy to see that. And I can still make you feel it. And I can still make you breathless just a little bit. Not every time you think you know me. Got me figured out. Throw a curveball right there. <laughs> Strike, right? So, I guess I get to go to first base. Maybe I'll make it to second. Hell, maybe it'll be a home run. <laughs> I love the fact that right now, you didn't expect that. You should have been on your toes more, huh? Maybe you gotta go on those toes. Kiss me, but... Even then, I can't get enough. So I guess you're stuck with all these kisses. Hey, I earned that first base fair and square. <laughs> and the rest of it... Let's just say I'm pretty good at cheating without cheating. <laughs> no, no, not in that way, baby. You think I could ever cheat on you? <laughs> Out of your fucking mind. If you think I ever would. And if you think there's someone better, fuck out of here with that. That's your insecurities talking. And I don't really appreciate those. So instead of letting them tell you you're not good enough, here's me shoving you up against the wall and telling you you are. <laughs> Feel a little better that way? Maybe make your heart flutter. <laughs> Maybe it goes down to your tummy, huh? Down here in this cute tummy. <sighs> Sorry, I couldn't resist. Work or not, mission or not. I guess I want to start it the right way. <laughs> Probably too distracting to call it work at this point, but... Don't care. Never have, never will. We'll get to that when the time comes and, you know, being fashionably late with you. Now that... That sounds more like us, doesn't it? Mm. <sighs> That's the reaction from my baby burn. Mm. The way you squirm. The way you want to say my name, but you can't quite get it out. Having your back to the wall and my body against yours. Too much stimulation for that brain of yours. <laughs> Come on, baby. Don't give me that. <laughs> if you keep acting like that, you'll just make me want you more. That way, I know. And I keep knowing how much you want me. Because God damn it, baby, Bert. I want you so fucking bad. Can't you feel it? <laughs> against the door that's supposed to lead outside to the cold hard worm. Instead, you've got a warm, hot and heavy bird right in front of you. Oh, you know who I am. <laughs> Not quite. More than that. More than that. <sighs> Might have to go out today. <laughs> As 
kinds of missions for heroes like that in the first place. Yeah, we're vigilantes now. Technically criminals. So I would be criminal of me not to take advantage of this quivering, beautiful nymph in front of me. Of this perfectly portioned and amazing body from head to toe. And those eyes looking at me with a bit of shock and a lot of desire. <sighs> to those toes that I want to make her. To that heart I want to make race. To all those little things in between. Those hands I want to hold. That waist I want to grab. I want to make you feel just for me, baby. And maybe I stole from us a story today. And so fucking what? Because even if I did, I don't feel any remorse. Not even a little bit. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. Guilty as charged, baby bird. Because I don't care what we do. As long as we're loving every second of it. As long as I can bite that lip and look you in the eye and see how much it shocks you. As long as I can see my cute little mess of a baby bird. A cute baby it drives me wild. Man to tell, I guess I've got it real bad for you. And something tells me I'll be getting acquainted with the store, but not, not to go to work. Not just yet. <laughs> Sorry, baby. I can't just stop right now. <laughs> if I did, would I really be the man you fell in love with? <laughs> if I ever been one to stop midway? And besides, it might not be that time of year, but it's definitely the time good enough. Fuck it. I don't care what we need to do because it's you. <sighs> so let me see what other reactions I can get out of you. <laughs> You're pretty good at getting them out of me too, I'll admit it. I'll give you credit where credit is due. But this time, well... <laughs> Last time I'd surprise you, won't it? <laughs> the more I can get of you, the better it's gonna be. The more I can feel your heart rise, the more it makes mine, steals my breath away. The more I <sighs> lose myself in that moment, I feel it. Down to my core, you know that. And that feeling, looking into those eyes. Like I'm a ravenous beast. <laughs> I can never be properly satiated. In some cases, that. And unless I feel that skin against my. Unless I have this arm wrapped around your waist and. Maybe just a little bit of <laughs> my old habits that I have trouble breaking. <laughs> I love you. More than that, I want you. <laughs> I don't care what happens next. I just care that it happens between you and me. And no, not a soul else. Because 
because I'm selfish, baby. And I don't want to share even a single breath wasted on anybody else. Not a soul. specialty. <laughs> Guess I got spoiled from all those years of being top hero in the whole wide world. <laughs> Couldn't get enough of that even if I tried. And I'm still, <sighs> still greedy, huh? Almost a shame, right? A shame that I want to unwrap you like a present. I want to feel you even closer. That's my baby bird, all right. Relax, okay? There you go. I want to kiss you until your brain melts. You don't mind too bad, do you? Sure you don't. <laughs> That's it. Just relax.
You're stuck with me, baby bird. <laughs> stuck with me to make another mess again. Maybe one we can't clean up so easy this time. What you think? <laughs> Not thinking much with that expression, huh? Well, let's see how much more I can make you make it. How much more I can make your 